I'll, I'll leave the crossing, bro. It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. I live in a beautiful day for a neighbor. Geraldton? Texas. <laughs> Would you seven five zero zero seven? Limington Road. Twenty nineteen. <laughs> hit me up with. Hit me up whenever you're ready, dog. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. It's tomorrow, right now. Hey, next shut year, the fuck hit up, me up when you're ready, bro. Fucking oh beaner. my goodness. Why you not? Hey, bro, I'm telling you, dog. I'm telling you where I live. That is some. You told me which tell you want live, bro. I told you I tell you want live, man. Hey, cuh. I nah, I don't know, bro. But I just told you why I live already, bro. This nigga. Uh, I think oh. you kids oh need God. some help in can't. here. Oh, I told you, bro. Oh, you write it down. Oh, fuck you. Oh, you want me to send you a message? Oh, oh, you. Oh. you want me to send you a message? Oh, you. So you can search it up on your iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> now hold it hard, bro. Want me to send you a message? Do you need a hug? Bro, I told you, bro. You what? You want me to send you in a message, bro? I give you my phone number too. Wow, I don't know, bro. Then I think. Violence is not the answer to solving those problems that you are having. Then, then how should we solve them? Well, would you like me to tell you a story? Yes. Just, yeah, just go on, bro. Say it, bro, to the story! There once was a young man. Yeah. What's the name? Who was a very nice man. What's the name though? He was a young man. What's the name though? About your age. And I'm this 16. man grew up without his grandfather. Yeah. His friend had a grandfather. Yeah. And his friend was a very young well-behaved boy. Yeah. And when the man without the grandfather Yo. was upset, Yo. he would treat the man with a grandfather disrespectfully, such as the way you are tonight. Now, oh. if you need help, then I suggest you tune in to my show yeah. And I can teach you how to behave like a young man should. Yo, what show is it? Have you ever heard of Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood? Nah. What's that, you like too? to go to the land of make-believe? Yeah, sure, bro. And I play with pups. Puts. Yeah, sure, why not, bro? I'm down. And meet friendly people. Yeah, bro. I like killing friendly people. Then I suggest you tune in to PBS. PBS? Your local public broadcast system. Yo! And look for Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. I'm down, bro. I'll do it when I got time. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Doug. I'm sorry, what would you calling me? A thug. T. H. U. G. A thug. Yeah, a thug. Now, what did I do to be called a thug? Why are you talking like that, bro? <laughs> He's talking all like. No, nah, I'm not talking so you're talking like I don't know bro, I'm not explaining it. Wait, I don't know. Voice. Well I'm just trying to I just try everyone does. When I got respect for them. I don't know bro, I don't know how to explain it, dog. But it's pretty badass. 
Yeah. I respect you. And I respect every human being that plays this game. Yo, me too, bro. We're not ready. This is the only way that I can keep up with today's youth, is to play this game. And if I can reach even one child, or one young adult, such as yourself... I'm 16, bro. Then perhaps we can work together to make this world a, a better good place. place for everybody. Fuck. To enjoy playing games such as this one. But well, why would you want kids to play body games? You might play like Little Bit Panic. I'm sorry, what did you say? I said, don't you want kids playing like Ready to E games instead of Ready to M? Like Call of Duty? They should be playing like Little Bit Planet or some shit, man. This game is rated M. Yeah. Because of little children who use violent words. For real? I don't know. No, no, not nigga. It's rated M because there's shooting, there's drugs up in this hole. Well, I think there is. I don't, I don't know. I don't get fucked up. I'm not even playing. Just some stingy ass motherfucker won't even play. Now, I don't appreciate the use of that word. What, motherfucker? Oh my goodness. I'm oh, sorry, bro. I want to say it again. Hey, bro, my homeboy wants to talk to you. Can you tell him the story again? What, to, what, to him? I'm sorry. What person was here? Um, it was Alfonso Coronado. My homeboy Jesse wants to talk to you. Well, like, he wants to hear the story. <coughs> Yo. <laughs> hey. What's his name? Hold up. What's his name? Hey, Rogers. You can call me Fred. Oh, my bad. Fred? Yes, sir. My friend, Jesse, would like to hear the story about the grandfather. Well, the story is not about the grandfathers. It's about the kids. It is about the young men. Oh, uh, well, I'm a pack, I'm a pack violence. What was it? Hello there, my friend. Oh. <laughs> yeah, what, what's up, man? <laughs> Have you ever seen my show? What's up, man? It's called Mr. Rogers Neighborhood. Oh, for real? <laughs> Wait a bit about Oh my huh? goodness, someone sounds like they're in peril. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's, that's my girl, man. Is she okay? Yeah, she's okay. It's because she couldn't handle it, you know? I'm sorry, what did she say? <laughs> she, can't, it, she can't handle it. She can't handle the language that's being used in this game. No. That's unfortunate. No. Well, I hope that you two have sorted out your differences. Nah, bro. There will be no peace up in this world, man. Not as I'm controlling it. How about we sing a song? I'm down to sing a song.
I'll start and everyone can follow. Yeah. It's such a good feeling. This feeling inside, it's such a happy feeling, knowing you're alive, and when you wake up, ready to say, I think I'll have a snappy new day. It's such a good feeling, April, April. a very good feeling, a feeling you know, that I'll be back when the game is through. And I'll have more ideas for you. Why I know the news. You'll have things you'll want to talk about. Talk about. I will to What's up guys? It's Tony here. Uh thanks for tuning in to the newest Mr. Rogers episode. Uh it was a lot of fun and uh <laughs> hope you enjoyed story time there. Anyway, I just want to give you an update. I know on my last Mr. Rogers video, I stated that I'd be playing as Macho Man Randy Savage. And I have played a few rounds. Uh, it is a little more difficult to get gameplays that are actually you know, entertaining enough to post for you guys to play as the Macho Man. Not a lot of people recognize him anymore, so it's a little bit tougher. But I'm going to keep plugging away for a few more tries and see if I can get a good one for you. Anyway, just make sure that you try to like this video if you were entertained by it. And definitely try to tell your friends, uh, share the video, and just kind of help me out. I really appreciate it. I like having fun playing these games, and I like you guys interacting with me. And hopefully I'm doing my best to uh, make you a satisfied subscriber. So anyway, take care, guys. I will see you next time.